Oh. Right. Uh. Morning. Well, the thing is, I've been doing it for, well, say 10 years. Every year I say I'm going to leave at Christmas, but for some reason or another they don't get anybody. And once it gets to the summer again, I can go round in my shorts and I'm happy. So I end up still being there the next Christmas. <laughs> Every paper's one less each day. <laughs> Thinking of retiring, but I don't know. In the winter when it's pouring down in the rain and the old lorries are going by and they throw the water all over you, that, that's when it becomes a bit tedious. <laughs> But it doesn't matter, keeps me fit, hopefully. <laughs> I'm up by six, and I normally read the previous day's paper until about seven then. I just like to get the paper round out of the way and then I've got the rest of the day to myself. I obviously started doing it when I was 11 years old, but then I left to start work when I was about 16. And then I started again when I i finish up, you know. They can't get youngsters to do it because they all have to, under normal circumstances, they have to catch buses to Mason or to Tenderson and if the papers arrive late, they can't do the paper rounds because they can't miss going to school <laughs> over a paper run. So that's why they find it difficult to find people to do the paper rounds. I had that done last Friday, the wife and I had that done. That was no problem. I did the paper around the following morning, apart from an aching arm, but that's where they threw the needle in it. <laughs> As you see, I, I bring a mask with me, um, but I don't see anybody. A couple of people normally stop in their car or something, you know, um, and have a quick chat. But uh, most of the people, they're mostly elderly on this round, they're in the garden weeding or doing something in the garden and we have a chat. So I normally say twice as long as I should do on the paper. <laughs> there was a very famous film, it can never be remade, it's called A Wonderful Life. Do you know what his name is in the film? George Bailey. His um, guardian angel came down in the film and trying to get his wings. And the only way he could get his wings was by doing a, a good favour to James Stewart, who played George Bailey. Now I'm waiting for Clarence to come down and look after me. <laughs> We're on the way home now, on the way back. And there's not many, there's seven more papers. And I'll be finished. Boom, 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 boom. Boom, 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 boom.